Hi, welcome to another Mostly Mike Show 2 Minute Quickie Tips and Reviews. My videos are not only free to watch, but you get to keep the tips. Today I'll show you a method that I discovered that makes the daunting task of cutting off overhanging shingles from a roof quick and simple. The best part is that a lot of you may already own one of these tools. The clock is running, so let's do this. So I've been working diligently on the garage storage area of the new Mostly Mike Show headquarters, which in part involved the construction of a boathouse to store my, well, <laughs> boat. What else? It's all part of the system to make better videos and more of them. You gotta trust me on this one. Now this boathouse roof led to other things such as the need for a metal roof over the entire garage. Well, after getting the bulk of the metal roofing installed, there's an end cap trim molding that gives the roof a nice transition to the white fascia beneath. With asphalt shingles, they're typically installed on an overhang of, oh, about one inch, which can interfere with the installation of said end cap trim, therefore requiring trimming of said shingles. Cutting off the shingle overhang can be a royal pain, but my method sort of sugarcoats the miseries associated, and all you need is an oscillating tool with an old worn out blade. While my oscillating tool happens to be a DeWalt, any brand or model should work. I'll be sure to include the Amazon link below for the oscillating tool. Amazon doesn't sell old worn out blades, so I'll include a link for some new ones. Clicking this link and buying anything even unrelated to the video helps improve future videos with a small commission that I make from each sale, which helps now more than ever since I've become recently unemployed. So let's take this thing up and give it a try. And here's where the magic begins. Just simply plunge through a random spot of overhanging shingles and drag it along like a knife through cheese. I think that it cuts so well from the heat generated through thousands of tiny oscillations with a touch of quantum physics, and it just melts its way through. This method worked really well for me, so I thought that I would pass it on to my incredible audience. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and especially comment if you enjoyed. Thank you for watching this Mostly Mike Show 2 Minute Quickie. Was it good for you?